Hey everyone, welcome to technically, I guess, day one, but you know, last night was the party night. But we're here at Armageddon, okay? and the drag racing is about to start. So let's go check it out. Everyone, welcome back. Thank you for joining me here at Armageddon. A little tip if you are coming straight ahead there's the arma tent that is where you register when you pull in to freedom factory there's going a y that heads over here to the drag strip you want to stay straight and then you stop at the tent and that's where you get all your swag you come around the corner here's your parking uh the bash pit is all the way at the end of this driveway behind that garage the big ramp and that's going to be over here in the stadium itself here is all your parking for now, and this is where people camp. The drag strip here is where they have a drag racing. Look, here's this guy. His YouTube channel's not as good as mine. But... No, it's not. <laughs> I'm working going? on it though. Hey, okay. It's Jetman. <laughs> How's it going? <laughs> good. Hey, what was your channel again? Uh, Rusty Screws RC. Rusty Screws. Okay. Yeah, I just started about two or three weeks ago, so. Brand new, brand new this. <laughs> yeah, that's all right. Man, you want to see some crazy cars, go check out this channel. <laughs> I can't wait to see this thing run. Ah, uh, thank you, thank you. <laughs> what do you, it's a 12S you uh, said? All, yeah, all, all three motors went on 12S. Damn! Oh, I got some turn stuff on the park. <laughs> yeah. Man, guys, I am sorry. I meant to bring my DSLR. I was gonna put the telephoto lens on just for this type of stuff, but we'll have to just make do with what I got. Check it out, man, guys, I found him. RC driver online. I'm here, I made it. He made it. Welcome to Florida. Thank you. <laughs> You guys couldn't turn on the air conditioner for me? <laughs> we tried, man. We tried. I asked them why they uh, did it this time of year. You know, they said, Whoa. you probably know more than foot. That was really cool. RC driver online. I get to meet him. Spent a couple minutes chatting. That was pretty cool. But, uh, let's turn on to some uh, drag racing here. I cannot wait to see the jet car. All right, we got a limitless. That thing sounds pretty fast. This should be interesting. He wasn't even on it. Good. Whoa. <laughs> that was your jet car. That's insane. That was the fastest though. Some guy hit one on two. That was 98. The jet car did 98. Damn. 104. <laughs> Funny. 8S Outcast. Man, guys, it is hot. It is hot. It's only uh, 10 in the morning. Uh, if you're coming out here, don't forget your sunscreen. I suggest you bring some water. I don't want to pay their prices. And insect spray. Because back of my legs are getting bit by the mosquitoes. So I'm going to take a little break and then we'll come back to some drag racing. And we'll check out some other stuff here. All right, he says 104. Oh! <laughs> you guys probably couldn't see that, but the. Uh, the speed guys down there <laughs> had to run for cover. But if you're out here drag racing and you wreck or your car won't come back to you, they'll bring it back to you. You don't have to walk down the track, so don't worry about it. I've seen a lot of people so far walking can get their cars, but there's no need to. Forty-seven. Yep. They blew a tire. 
All right, this is supposed to be the runoff of the two fastest cars, 104 mile an hour. Check it out. Seven eight. All right, I think this is the hundred mile an hour cars. So they just announced on the radio there's two limitlesses that are gonna run. Whew, it's hot, man. I'll touch on. I'll touch on. I'll give you some info about why they did this event here and now when this wraps up. So stand by. Ninety-eight. 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 Eighty-seven. All right. So uh, that concludes drag racing for today. I believe for today. So now, yesterday I talked to the guys at Arm. I said, "Why did you do this over Memorial Day weekend?" And he told me that they were trying to do this last year. They couldn't get anything over here booked. Uh, even this was kind of a last minute thing. So I know that's, that hurt a lot of people because it's such short notice that a lot of people just don't have the time to get out here. And so far from what you see, it kind of looks like the attendance reflects that possibly. It is Friday, so maybe Saturday. We'll have some more out here. Um, so that's why they're having it now. They did say they, they want to aim for more like in October, even though here in South Florida, it's still, or I guess Central Florida, it's still hot. Still hot in October, but maybe it'll be a little bit better. Uh, and they said the reason they had it at the Freedom Factory, they were looking at other locations, and they said uh, nobody wanted to take on the responsibility, I guess, of 40 pound RC cars way up in the air. So. Uh, yeah, they didn't want the responsibility. You know, if you watch car stuff and you watch Cleus, and you know, they do some crazy stuff. So they're like, oh, launching some cars? Not a problem. But uh, yeah, I guess other places didn't want the liability of people running loose with these cars. You see some easily hit 100. And uh, the, get 100 feet in the air, 50 feet in the air, whatever it is. But, yeah, so that's why it's the Freedom Factory, because it's just liability. Nobody wanted to host such an event, and then they had it here just because it was last minute. But they, they do want to change the timing, maybe like in October. So hopefully they can get that scheduled. There will be more advance notice, and more people can come here. Oh, here is the Basher Pit. Man, you see the ramp on this thing. Wow. So look, I'm guessing that's theirs. It looks like it is. And then you have other ramps here. You got two ramps here to jump the Crown Vic. This will be interesting when, uh, okay, we got one person, so. All right. Gotta watch where the sun is so it doesn't mess up the shots. So let's go let's see what else we can find out. Pretty cool, the Cletus driving car is uh I don't know if I'd pay to have him or any of his people drive me around this track. Cool looking cars. So they said they're gonna have a speed oval. People are gonna race around here later. And then. Way down there, you can see that ramp. That thing is, golly, at least 15 feet. And then they have other ramps over here that are gonna be set up, so we'll have some events down there later. <laughs> You're talking about for the readers, right? Yes. Yeah. They're in the computer, but I look all through that monster. Yeah. Uh, I'll play all of them. Okay. Oh, yeah.
I'm here for a hockey plug. I got here though. You need to borrow a car. I kind of really want to own mine. I never, never beat on stuff like that. Check it out. You can buy a car and parts here. If you need it. Get pro lines. Arm parts. Let's see what else. Holy, look at the size of this. I got a uh, All right, I'll nitro RC car. Oh, wow. Which one you got? It's the M2C. Well, that's, I guess that's the M2C cat. I'm not sure what this one is. Maybe I guess it's all still M2C. The size of these motors. Oh my god. It's insane. Oh man, the owner there of uh, MTC was just telling me how to set the droop on the 8S crate and to help not bend axles with. And there's some stout axles that he's got. So I kind of I think I missed getting over here to to do the, the speed lap. I'm not sure if I can cross the track now, but I think we'll be able to film from here. Should be okay. That's a fast little problem. He's done. Yeah. Look out here. Oh, I missed it. Look. He's tired. If you don't know, there was a Mont Prix out here on uh, Mother's Day weekend. He found it. He found the wheel nut. Dude, that, damn, that's unreal. Very good. Looking beautiful on the back stretch. Oh, 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 oh. good save. Good save. Sit at home. Sit at home. Nice job, Eric. Wow. Good looking run. Damn, that's probably one of the cleanest yeah. runs yet. That was a 2682. Nice work. Looking good, looking good. Yes, it looks like a beautiful run. Looking good, looking good. Bring it home, buddy. Bring it home. All right, everyone. It is. It's hot. Try to. Turn into 2764. Catch as much of it as I could for you. I'm gonna have to go to the car, get some water, and maybe cool off a little bit. Then we'll get back at it. Oh man, I've already drank an entire liter. I'm not usually a big water drinker either. It is hot. It's hot out here. Matter of fact, I forgot to mention too, I had to take a break because the GoPro was getting hot. It was so hot in my hand. I used my uh, thermometer in here 
that I use with RC cars, and that battery is 140. Little lithium for the uh, GoPro. So yeah, I had to give the GoPro a break too, even if it was getting too hot. So let's go see what's going on. All right, guys, I promise you another view of this stuff during the daytime. Look at this insanity. <laughs> 20 P's. This, this, thing, this thing's got so much motor alone. Like, the motor, and he's got the doctor <laughs> fans on these things. It's crazy. But yeah, hopefully you can see a little bit better today. In, in the daylight, check out his channel. Russell Rusty Screws RC. Thank you. Yeah. Check him out, man. Cool guy. We've been hanging out here chatting, but they got an event up here, so let's go check it out. I'm quite sure what this is, but we're going to go check it out and see what's happening over here. Oh, cool guy, man. Give me some water. Nice place to go. Uh, sit down in the shade and cool off a little bit. Sun is finally behind the clouds. Get a little break out here. And guys, it's been hot. Whew. Ain't gonna lie. All right, so this is the ramp. So no, it's about. So I'm six one, so it's maybe seven feet the most. A little lot bigger from a. But there's the thing they're gonna catch your car in. Let's see what's going on here. What? Oh, that's what they meant by drag race. Dragging something. There you go. That's the armless take on a drag race. It's dragging a pan with a water bottle in it. If they continue to do that, this was I'd use like a crawler or something that's got like that low end or something that wants low end. A brushed car would probably be best for it. You can hear the brushless ones. Or no, actually, you could run a brushless, but a censored. Yeah, that's what I would run. A censored, but something that can handle that slow speed like that because you can just hear them cogging really bad that stuff so All right, Brian, you got a 44, or i don't think it's that that interesting but you know that's hey that's one of the events i'm pretty sure this video is already gonna get crazy long so I'm trying to limit give you a little taste of everything and not show you the entire event otherwise this video will be like two hours long Check it out, guys. They got the tug of war going on. Tying two RCs together. See who can pull who. That's one of the cool events I had here. So, uh, 
move on to the next one. All right, man, last event of the evening, the long jump. This should be good. I think some people might, might wreck, wreak some havoc. Sorry, it's been a long day in the heat. It's been a long day. It's fun, and uh, glad to bring this to you for those of you that couldn't make it out here. So. That's some extra points, land on the cone. Yeah, target practice. Oh. Entrance to that ramp is brutal. You can just hear the cars plowing into that thing. It's such a you know, look at it, such a so the cars are hitting it and just plowing. It really needs a, a smoother. I should have used like a plastic to make that just a better transition. Ooh. All right, guys, I'm going to do one more, and then we're going to wrap it up. Look, that was an XO cage RC over there. Yeah, All right, guys, we're going to wrap it up there. I think this is the last event for tonight. It's been a long, hot day. I'm going to go back to the hotel, grab a shower, and get this video out for you. Hope you enjoyed watching uh, day two out uh, here at uh, Armageddon. Make sure you subscribe, stay tuned for tomorrow's adventures. That'll be a whole nother day. All right, everyone, take care. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.